conflict of interest in legal malpractice here in Massachusetts. Good morning, my name is Neil Burns and I'm a lawyer along with my partner, Rashawn Jan. We represent victims of legal malpractice in Massachusetts and I've been asked to talk about conflict of interest and how that comes up and, and why it's a problem and why these are legal malpractice cases. And while it happens in divorce and criminal cases sometimes when the lawyer is trying to represent both sides, usually the court will stop that, will we'll prevent that, will we'll impose some, some guardrails so that doesn't happen. But the cases that we see mostly are in um, personal injury cases where the lawyer thinks that they can represent the driver and the passenger when there's some liability on the driver. Can't do that. Uh, that happens in trusts and estate cases. We see that a lot of where you know, you're trying to represent uh, two family members against another family member. You think you're representing the, the trustee of a trust and, or an estate and really the beneficiary has a conflict of interest uh, with the trustee. Uh, it happens with corporations when there are uh, an, an attorney trying to represent uh, the corporation and one of the corporate officers. And we see it in, in divorce cases, not so much in representing both sides in the divorce, but in the prenups. So you have a lawyer that says, yeah, I can represent both sides um, in a prenup, and maybe they get you to sign some sort of um, waiver or whatnot, but it's, it's not gonna work. Two parties have two separate interests most of the time, uh, in a, certainly in those examples. And there's no reason why you can't get a second lawyer to protect both people. Lawyers can work well together, but when they see the conflict, they will represent their own client and not the other client. If you're a victim of legal malpractice because your lawyer represented two sides, give us a call. The insurance defense attorneys on these cases are very, very aggressive. For some reason, they don't like this, this claim. Uh, they, they don't see it uh, as clearly as we do, but we've been very effective because we've been very aggressive in prosecuting these claims on behalf of clients, on behalf of victims. So if you're a victim of legal malpractice, call Burns and Jan. It's a free initial consultation. 617-227-7423. Thank you.